Hallelujah, hallelujah. Praise the higher, everybody. Praise the higher. One more time, praise the higher from whom all blessings flow. Amen, amen. This is your sister, Carrie Ann, and Yesiah the Christ. Yesiah the Messiah. <clears throat> sorry. Yesiah of Nazareth. If you want to know why I call higher God, higher, and the biblical Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Yesiah, I've done a video. It's always linked in the description box and pin comment section. All right. So if you want to know the reason why, check out the videos because I'm not going to go in a comment and explain myself all over again it's going to take forever in a day all right greetings greetings to the 12 scattered tribe of yashahel hallelujah yashahel el at the end is a name given to jacob jacob name was not changed to israel that is man-made the proper hebrew name is yah Shahel, El, that is the name. So I greet all the Hebrew Yashahelites all over the world in 2022, scattered to the four corners of the earth, whom the Most High, Ahaya, is getting ready to be regathered. Hallelujah. That we will be gathered as a people, as a nation, as Yashahelites in one vicinity. Glory to your name, Lord. And I'm looking forward to the second exodus amen the wilderness if you call it so or the woman in revelation 12 okay uh, and also greetings to the outstanding <laughs> outstanding amen body of the messiah Messiah, the church how can you forget the church you cannot you see yeah uh, yeah you cannot talk about just the Hebrew Israelites and that's it. And don't talk about the body of Christ because you've got to talk about the body of Christ. Amen. Because he has a church. Hallelujah. And he's coming back for his church. <laughs> Glory to your name. So I agree the body of the Messiah, the church. Hallelujah. Whom we will be regathered. I'm not regathered, but whom we will gather. Hallelujah. To meet Yesiah. Hallelujah. Someday, someday, someday. Glory to your name. All right. So quick housekeeping, brothers and sisters, before going further. Remember, when I make a comment, my name is Sister Carrie Ann. It is in solid gray border. If it's not solid gray border, Sister Carrie Ann, and somebody's pretending to be me, always look for the name. That's a dirty devil. You need to rebuke and report them. Also, if you're watching this channel, you do not know Yesiah, you do not know the biblical Christ as your personal savior, Lord and friend. You're not walking in his light, in his integrity, in his way, in his commandment. Please watch a video till the end. There's a sinner's prayer there for you. We want you in glory. Hallelujah. We don't want you to go to hell. The hell, hell belongs to Satan. And thirdly, remember the backup channel, brothers and sisters, please subscribe. I can't tell you enough. You know, it's a backup channel. You need, if you're watching this channel, you need to nip over and just subscribe just in case, God forbid, if anything happened to this channel. So please go over and subscribe to the backup channel. It's called Pioneering End Time Ministry or Petem. It's in, the link is in the description box or the pin comment section. All right, on here we do something called the top 20. I love the top 20. I love calling up brothers and sisters name in the most style. Uh, higher. It is, you know, you know, yes, I do love it, but it's also to train your spirit, teaching you to be sober, watchful, vigilant, um, observant. What are you observing for? For the times and the season, because Yesiah is coming back when everything is said and done. All right, top 20 brothers and sisters, I need the powerful video concerning, let me write it down, just bear with me, brothers and sisters, because my camera, hallelujah, my camera is working now. From, it's about, for about a year and a half, I've been trying to hold stuff up like that. I've been holding stuff up like that. I mean, it's going to work now anyway. I've been holding up stuff and it's turning back for people. Brothers, this is a Karen. We can't read it. And I tried to get the thing to work. It wouldn't work. But a beautiful beloved, hallelujah, in the most high, reach out to me and says, this is a Karen. This is what you do to get your camera to flick so that when you hold things up, oh, yes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This is what's one of the trouble because I used to hold up my Bible, my King James, see it there? And it used to turn back, back and forth. Um, upside it down but it's not anymore so yeah so this is my bible that i use brothers and sisters i'm not gonna hide my face but this is my bible my good old king james bible that i use all right um look so it's gonna work so you can see all right okay it's very cheeky really somebody in the comment section i've blocked them because i'm not I'm, you know what i'm literally not into going back and forth with people in the comment section but somebody was very cheeky in the comment section saying oh sister karen you're following people 
holding up stuff. If they watch this channel, then you, well, those of you who watch this channel know that I've been trying to hold stuff up for the longest of time. It wouldn't work, but now it's working. I ain't following nobody, so I don't know what they're talking about. All right. So yesterday I left a very, very powerful video on, let me write it down. Hallelujah. And I've also, brothers and sisters, says, Sister Karen, um, please write in black pen and please get some index card. I've ordered some index cards and I've ordered my, my, my Sharpie, my Sharpie markers, all right? Um, so I can write all properly. But yesterday I did a very powerful video on this country. All right, I did one on them. Very, very powerful. you got to watch them. The reason being, anything that you see going off down here, in this country, it's a foreshadow of what to come. Remember the Devoc? <laughs> the Devoc started down there, isn't it? The Devoc started with that. And um, and what they're doing to people, this people down there right now in 2020 is very, very wicked. And you cannot turn a blind eye. So it's not us. We're in the West. We're safe. <laughs> Watch the big sea. Watch the dragon country. Because whatever goes off there will mimic, will mimic all over the world. I've said it yesterday. This country have, have already gone into the new world order. They have. They have started it. And you're seeing snippets of it. The food shortage. Locking the people up long fences. This and that. Very, very wicked people. Asian spirit that's ruling them. Alright. So these are the top 20 brothers and sisters underneath that video. You know, the big C. Alright. Okay. Here we go. So. Let me find it. All right. Shana <coughs> Fisher. Majel belong to Yesaya Yesuma. Emma Scarlett. Shakira Henry. Melody Manguro. Edna Gaese. Rachel Eki Orobo. Abibi Samson. Dwight Hill. Mahula Buddha Butter, Rebecca K, Siobhan Maloney, Cage, no, no, sorry, I do beg your pardon, Gage, Gage in his glory, hallelujah, Kate Dungu, Jada green and jada this video really and truly you left a, a, a note an outstanding comment and this video is about the comment that you made which i'm going to go in in a minute hallelujah so thank you jada <clears throat> okay conroy jones kensua all things made new yaz daughter adiola sings ziba Broad Knox, Valerie Jarrett, and Conroy Jones. Hallelujah. These are the beautiful top 20. One well, sister who made it underneath that video concerning this country and their long fences. All right. Very, very wicked. Okay, brothers and sisters. So remember to continue to, you know, like, subscribe, comment. Do your thing to help the video reach to other people who don't know about this channel. All right. We are near. That is our theme banner. We're not only near to the, um, to, to the returning of the beautiful Messiah. Hallelujah. The King of glory, but we're also near to the revealing of the dirty antichrist and the lawlessness of sin. The lawlessness of sin is basically the new world, the NWO. All right. We also have a prophetic theme song. This is a song that my good old mommy taught me when I was a little girl. She used to hide stuff and she used to sing how near you are. And the song came back to me and it's just such a fitting song for these end times. We are near to everything you can think of. The second Exodus, the return of the most high, uh, you know, um, all sorts, revealing of the Antichrist, the new world order, the exaggeration of sin. We are near. Hallelujah. So the song goes like this. Oh, now you are, oh, now you are, oh, now you are, oh, now, oh, now you are, oh, now you are, oh, now you are, oh, Hallelujah. Yes, 
we are in there and we can sing that song with right confidence hallelujah hallelujah okay brothers and sisters so remember mention that jada a beautiful sister called jada green all right she left a uh, a cracking comment a cracking comment my british would say a cracking comment all right because to be honest with you brothers and sisters listen I don't watch MTV. I'm not in the music, music stuff. I don't watch movies. I don't watch the news. I don't watch celebrity news. So I don't know what's going on in terms of the celebrity that's having their thing. Obviously with the Oscar slap, yes, I knew about that because it was all over my timeline. All right. It was all over the timeline. So that's something that nobody could really escape because it was right in your face, really and truly. But Underneath the video, this video, large fences, caging in the people, this country, caging the people with fences, right? Sister Jada Green left a comment. I'm going to read the comment for you because when I saw this, I had no idea. I had no clue. I had no clue, brothers and sisters, that this, these things were going on. But the destruction is very, 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 very real. <laughs> It's very real off the back of the Oscar slap. They just have to keep coming with the distraction. But watch this. This is what Sister Jada left. And I said, no, I have to do a video and chime in on this. I have to chime in on this because I see the distraction. Very, very wicked. This is all about... Let me just write it down, brothers and sisters, while I'm talking to you. This, this distraction. Hallelujah. Just a minute, brother and sister, just bear with me because, you know, I don't preempt to write stuff because, you know, I, I don't know what I'm going to talk about. But anyways, this, all this destruction is about this country. It's all about that, them. And their new kids. That's all it is because the, because the dirty Caesars, the dirty Caesars know that this country will be sending the flying scroll let me call it that the fire the fire scroll they know so they're distracting the people to, so that the people cannot be prepared all right so watch this brothers and sisters so the the oscar slap wasn't enough because people recognize and say all right this is a distraction what a view that wasn't enough so here where is this here's a distraction now so, Sister Jada, thank you so much, beloved. May the most I bless you and your husband. All right. So, this beautiful sister wrote, Brothers and sisters, I felt led to encourage others as well as myself to be wary of getting sucked. Hallelujah. Into celebrity drama. Are you listening to this sister? Are you listening to this beautiful, beautiful sister? She says, let me read it again. Brothers and sisters, I felt led. Listen to me, Sister Jada. This is the Holy Spirit that's speaking in you. Then you post this underneath the video of that of the country, of this country, where I did the video, right? Okay. That's Holy Spirit speaking. Because there's a lot of Christians, there's a lot of so-called believers walking with higher, they're sucked into celebrity drama, into the news. My God, they live for it. And it's all a massive distraction. And if you're getting distracted by these things, you need to get off social media. Go on fasting. If you can't get off it because it's demonic and you're in it, go on a couple days fasting and ask the Mosa to break that trend for you. I am telling you, ask him to purge you. But anyways. So the sister says, I felt let to encourage others as well as myself. You see that? She put herself in it. This is a good woman. Because normally you put stuff out and it's, you just, you know, like you're bashing other people. But she, she's literally put herself in it. Um, I'm not going to put myself in it. And, and it's not because I'm better than anybody. The, the reason why I'm saying this, because if I put myself in it, I would be lying. Because I don't watch celebrity news. I don't know the latest or anything like that, unless something pops up like the Oscar slap, because I don't watch that. I used to, absolutely. Oh, 
I used to watch them. I really did. I really, really did, but not anymore. All right. So she concluded herself in it and um, be wary of, of being sucked into celebrity drama. Watch this. There are three. I had no idea. I thought the Usla Slap and Jada Pinkett Smith was the, you know, still carrying on. I don't know. What a view. But watch this. This is what caught me eye. And this is why I'm doing the video. There are three major court cases Excuse me pain. listen to listen to the lady listen to the sister listen there are three there are three major court cases going on with celebrity and i'm presuming that this is in babylon this Babylon, this country, mystery, Babylon. And if you don't know that this country that I'm holding up is Mr. Babylon, that this country is spoken of in Revelation 18 and Revelation 17, you need to go and read Revelation 18 and 17. There's no other country. There's no other country in this world standing in 2022 that fits the description of Revelation 8, 17 and 18. If you can name me one country, then I stand corrected and I will do a video apologizing for calling this country Babylon. But for now, if anything changes in the future, so let it be. But for now, this country that I'm holding up, this is Mr. Babylon. This is Babylon, this country. All right. Okay. Watch this. I've logged out. <clears throat> iPad don't take long to log out. So watch this. So I'm presuming because I know these, I know of these people. Um, obviously I'm going to call their names. But um, but but the, she said there's three major court cases going on in Babylon. Major. Right. Okay. So she puts the reason I know it's Babylon. Them. Johnny. D, that's Johnny Depp, isn't it? Johnny D, I know of Johnny D. Why? Why do I know Johnny D? Because to be, I did watch the franchise. <laughs> I thought that was wicked. I did watch, and I did like it actually. Pirates of the Caribbean. All right, Pirates of the Caribbean. Um, I did watch the franchise of that, so I know about John, Johnny Depp and everything like that. I don't know who is Amber, Amber H. I, I don't know. Johnny D. D. Johnny D, that's Johnny Depp. Ham and she put a slash. Hamber H, I don't know who is that. But something is going on between them two, Johnny and Hamber. Obviously, Kardashian have done many videos on these witches. Because that's who they are. I'm calling them out. I'm, I'm literally, and I'm waiting. I'm literally waiting for Ye Kanye, to call out his, is his ex-wife now. To tell the truth, to tell the world the truth, who she is. I believe you will. I, re I truly believe in my spirit that ye, that Kanye will do a video and tell the world that which the Kardashians, they're not normal. Yeah. Anyway, so something is going, so because court case, isn't it? So she's put Kardashian slash China. China. She spelled the name China. I'm thinking, all right, when I was wicked, there was a girl. She used to have two, um, two, what do you call it? Oh, oh gosh. Piercing in her cheeks. And, and when I used to listen to Nicki Minaj, I think she used to run around with Nicki Minaj. I think it's this the girl. I think she's called, I think she's called Black. China or somebody like that but if I'm wrong please forgive me but it's just the how she spell the name but there was a girl called Black China with two thingy bobby in her cheeks I'm sure that's the one I'm pretty sure it may be her if she's if it's not her I'm sorry I'm really really sorry all right but there's something going on court case going on with Kardashian and somebody called China which because of the spelling of the name I'm thinking of that girl with the two piercing in her cheeks black china or somebody like that but anyways and then there's one going on with megan 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 
right? Um, I mean, she didn't write out the full name, but she's a celebrity. So I've done a video on a, on this girl called Megan V. Stallion. I'm thinking it's her because she's a celebrity. And she didn't put the full name, oh, Lord. But um, I'm just putting it out there. All right, I think she's talking about Megan V. Stallion because I've done a video on Megan Thee Stallion and Cardi B. That these people, <laughs> yeah, the demonic is real. The demonic is real, brothers and sisters. So, so this is who I think that um, Jada is talking about. Um, the Kardashian and the girl with the two piercing in her cheek. She's called Black China. Johnny Depp and uh, Amber H. I don't even know who that is. And then Megan and this person called Tori. Tori. Uh, uh, sorry. I don't know. I don't know. If I was, you know, when I used to listen to, and I used to watch MTV and the late, I would have known all these people. But I've outgrown. I've outgrown all these things. I've grown up. You know, I'm not into these celebrity stuff. But I know a few of them on here. Um, Shirley Johnny, Kardashian, and Megan. I think it's Megan the Stallion. But listen to this. So she says, my husband and I were given the revelation that these case reflect the judgment. Coming to Babylon. <clears throat> yes. Yes, Sister Jada. You're absolutely right, my love. That's what it is. It reflects the judgment. Come on now coming to Babylon, right? So be sober, be vigilant. There are little fires everywhere. I love this. This is a gem. Little fires everywhere. There was a fire the other day with the Oscar slap, wasn't it? With Will Smith slapping Chris Brown in his face. No, sorry, not Chris Brown. Chris Rock in his face. He didn't have to do it. But the Jezebel spirit in Jada. Come on now. See that? That's, that's a Jezebel spirit. That, it's a very wicked spirit. That Jezebel is very, very wicked. And for that moment when you saw, it's not about Will Smith, sorry, but I don't have to mention it. But for that moment when you saw Will slap Chris Rock, because Chris Brown, Chris, right? Chris Rock. When you see that slap go ahead, please know that that was a spirit of Hahab. Hahab is a Hebrew Yashahelite. He was a king of uh, of of Yashahel. He was a king of Judah. He was a Judah. So I'm getting mixed up here. <laughs> he was a Judah. Oh my God. Oh Judah. Oh, I'm so sorry, brothers and sisters. Right. So Ahab. All right. Is a Hebrew Yashahelite. He's from the tribe of Judah. All right. And he's a king over Yashahel. So I saw that spirit of Ahab in Will Smith. And I meant to mention it in my videos. And I'm not going to do another video to just tell the peep, brothers and sisters that, that Ahab's spirit is in Will Smith. But he has. He's got Ahab's spirit. Go and read Ahab and Jezebel. You'll see. Ahab is like, woe is me. Woe is me. I can't do this. Uh, uh, I need help from Jezebel. Good old Jesse. Whatever Jesse says, I have to do everything to please Jesse. Listen, that's Will Smith. He's got the Hayab spirit. It's very sad to watch and see, but he has. But anyways, brothers and sisters, it's not about Will Smith, this video, but I just put him in there, isn't it? Because a whole lot of them is a bunch of distraction, though. But yes, Sister Jada, little fires everywhere, she says. There are little fires everywhere, and she's correct. Little fires, some of them are not so little, some of them are big, but <clears throat> I understand the reality behind what she's saying. So all these court cases, brothers and sisters, I stand with this blessed sister. Do not, listen, do not be drawn into this celebrity stuff. It's all, I, I did a video last year, 2020, I talk about the three Ds. The three Ds of 2020. It's not 2021 I did it. 2020. I'm sure it's 20. Yeah. 2020. The three Ds of 2020. Which is distraction. Disturbance. 
distraction, distract and another this. I forgot another this. There's three of them. Powerful video. If I find it, I'll leave it pinned. But brothers and sisters, listen to me. This is all about this. Where are we? Let me go back. It's all about two countries. It's all about this country and that country. This these little fires, as the sister calls it. This country here, all right? And that country here. It's all about these two countries. Because heaven knows that they're gearing up. Huh? They're gearing up like world wind to come against Babylon. And then and, and the, the funny thing about it is that Babylon, Mr. Babylon, this country right here, knows exactly what they're in for. They know this is Bible. And listen to me, they're using all these so-called celebrity that's that's just underneath Satan's wing to to to, to distract the church. But you as a body of Christ, you must not be distracted by this. You must remain sober, just like what Sister Jada says with her husband. You must remain sober, learn to be sober, learn to be vigilant, learn to be watchful, learn to be observant, learn to be alert in your spirit. They may say that, oh, you're too spiritual. So let it be. So let it it be yes i want to be over spiritual let it be because you're safeguarding yourself because the truth of the matter is when push come to shove and when <clears throat> and when the bear country all right i call them the bear country when the bear country because they've been, they have been provoked they have been provoked a lot and when Drip, drip, Vladdy, all right? Because, you know, these people are, 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 they're run by demons. Anyway, I've got a very powerful video to do about drip, drip, Vladdy, what the Lord showed me concerning drip, drip, Vladdy. But, listen to me. I've done a video about this already, and, 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 I've, and I've warned the body. I have warned the body of Yesiah. And I said it, I told you, brothers and sisters, Gear up yourself. Go and buy your new stuff. Go and buy your new stuff. Because. Oh God. God did that. This city. Alright. This city. Sorry for me and writing. If it looks really bad. Don't apologize. This city. I am telling you brothers and sisters. The whole of Babylon will not be destroyed. It's not yet. This is not because Babylon will be destroyed after the rapture. You have to understand that. Go read Revelation 18 and 17. The Bible says that Ahaya remembered Babylon. And after Ahaya remembered Babylon, then all the destruction began to happen. So that's way down in Revelation 17 18 but before that the rapture has taken place so the church will not be here both in the wilderness aka the second exodus and those who have overcome the mark of the beast will be where Yesiah is so you will not be caught up in this foolish that's going to happen this destruction that's going to happen in mystery babylon because when mystery babylon this country is completely destroyed no human being all right no human being will be able to live there. It will be filled with devils and demons and all sorts of filthy creatures. Go read Revelation 18 and 17. All right? <clears throat> but, 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 before the complete destruction, listen to me very carefully. Before, this is why they're having the destruction with the celebrities. That's the whole reason, because they know. So before the complete destruction, destruction of this country, this city will be Nuki. The flying fire. All right? The flying fire. And when this happens, they're going to introduce the 666. Because, the, because we know right now in 2022 that this is a financial hub of the whole entire world, isn't it? But equally... Listen to me now.
Now, let me write this down because th th this is important. Now, I, I did a video and I said if I can't wait to get my flashcards because I could just quickly write. I've, I've got an A4 and I've bent it. So. <laughs> All right. So listen to me now. Oh gosh, I can't wait to get my card. I'm sorry, small brothers and sisters. If this country is not hit first, listen to me very carefully because the destruction is real. We call out the destructions and more things. If this country is not nuke, nuke first, then they will definitely, definitely come on in the name of the Lord. This, this one is on the agenda. Do you understand what I'm saying? Sorry, let me hold it properly. This one right here, this country right here is on the agenda. So it's either NY or this one. One out of the two, it's coming. And when we talk about this country, we've talked about that this city, not this country, this city right here is going to go underwater. But before it goes on the water, it will experience fire from. Oh, gosh. <laughs> it will experience fire from this, from them. So, NY and. And, um, I don't know what calling it. NY and UK will feel the wrath of them and also the wrath of them because these two countries this one this country the bear and the dragon they're in cahoots they're working together the body is the best friends a high never lies um gog and magog sorry i'm holding it up so the revelation that Sister Jada and her husband got concerning warning the body of Christ. She literally warned, I should have pinned that, you know what, I really should have pinned that comment, but I pray that people will see it. I might go back and just find it and pin it. But um, it's a distraction because you see the dirty Caesars, then you see, well, they have all these little fires, as the sister calls it, all these little fires. This, this court case with Johnny Depp here, this court case with the Kardashian here, that court case with Megan Thee Stallion, um, all sort of things going off, kicking off, and what of you. You have to understand that the devil is planning for humanity. And what the Lord is saying, you have to be prepared. Because wherever judgment finds your heart, that's where you will be judged. You cannot blame nobody for not being prepared. I've done a video and there's other people out there who have done more extent video than me, you know, concerning, um, I don't like to call it no culture. Let me just put it down. Look at my key, my wonky key. <clears throat> Concerning that preparedness, readiness. I'm trying to get it out my face. Oh, I can't get it out my face. Oh, Lord. All right, it's too big, you see. That's why the paper is massive. All right, so a lot of um, other YouTubers out there have done more excellent video than me, more in more depth. I mean, I've talked about how to prepare for this, but mine is very superficial. You know, get your flashlight, get your goggles but they do all sort of other things and this is going to happen this this is no hifs bots or maybe well i'm telling you yeah it's coming brothers and sisters a massive what time is it oh i've got to finish now massive destruction all right okay hallelujah so if you come to the end of the video <laughs> time is running out if you come to the end of the video if you do not if you have not accepted Yesiah as lord and savior um uh, please repeat the sinner's prayer after me i will leave it link in the comment section and the description box all right if you want to accept the most high Yesiah 
hallelujah as your Lord and Savior. Please repeat after me. All right. So I call him Yesiah because that's his Hebrew name and nobody can tell me any different. If you feel comfortable calling him Jesus Christ of Nazareth, he will still hear you because he knows who you're talking about. All right. Okay. Dear Yesiah the Christ, I know <clears throat> that you are the son of Ahiah whom the world calls God. I believe that Yesiah have died on the cross for my sins. Yesiah, I thank you for dying for me. And, and I believe in your death, burial, resurrection, and that Ahiah has raised you from the dead. I know with confidence that you are the son of Ahiah. Amen. Yesiah, king of glory, I come before you right now <clears throat> and I'm asking you to wash away all my sins and to forgive me for all that I have done wrong. I repent from my wicked ways. Ahia, I thank you for your beautiful son, Yesiah. And I pray that you will help me to live a life of repentance and give up the things displeasing to you in this world. Thank you for salvation and thank you for saving me. Hallelujah. If you send this prayer and you believe it in your, in your heart, welcome to the body of Yesiah. Hallelujah. Leave a little comment in the comment section if, if you've accepted the most um, Yesiah as your personal Lord and Savior. We believe in Acts 2 verse 38 hallelujah we believe in acts 2 and verse 38 and um, you've done the repenting part you know you've repented you just need to find a man of the most die a higher and ask him to baptize you in water you need to fully fully emerge into water from head to toe underneath water it represents your spiritual transformation which means that you um you 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 believe in the in the in the um in the atonement of sin that Yesiah died on the cross for you, when you raise out of the water, um, you raise into his resurrection. All right. So, um, yes, please do that. So be bold. Time is going up. My thing's going to run out. Be so be bold, be strong, be courageous. Walk with a higher, just like Enoch. All praises. A beautiful praises to the most high, a higher who lives above the heavens. A higher eternally bless you. I love you all. And I will see you soon. Someday in glory. In Yesiah's holy name, amen and amen. Let's say the benediction. The benediction is Jude chapter 1. Jude chapter 1 verses 24 to 25. The Bible reads, Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy to the only wise Yesiah, our Savior, be glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and ever. Amen and amen. Amen. Blessings. Amen.